What is going on everybody? My name is Insomniac Anvil and welcome back to Bannerman. Blakesley Civic Center. Now if you're wondering why I'm waking up here, I did record the beginning of this episode. Um, I was going to split this one into two because it was quite long. Don't know if I'm still going to do that, but I ended up losing footage, which is not fun. Uh, it, you know, it's kind of disappointing, but stuff like that happens, I guess. You can't beat yourself down about it. Just got to push through it, keep on going. Unfortunately, I don't, there's no restart option. You could um, delete this the, the file, the main save file, and then restart the whole game again. Don't particularly want to do that. That would take time. And I'd rather just keep on going. It was cool though. I woke up. It was day six. It is day six. We 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 went to the pub that we saw at the at the end of the last episode. Lord Crowley and Lord Randall were there. And then we woke up. It was a false awakening. And then we woke up normally. And now we've been sent to this town. We're supposed to go in all by ourselves. And we're supposed to cause. Or well, we're supposed to slip in, open the gate, something like that. I don't know. But anyway, um, ended up getting chased and fell off a building and and died I guess, passed out, and then ended up somewhere else, and then I got to the end of that, and then what happened? The next scene was a boat, got out of the boat, got attacked, got killed a bunch of times, so yes, yeah, so we're going to try to get back to that point. That's that's the idea, but I'm going to go through, we'll go down here, I'll show you around a bit. I'll show you around, this here is just the, um, oh, I don't need to go this way. That's just the quick cut to the very end, I probably could go straight there, but I don't want to because I want to show you guys around and stuff, so then again, I guess we won't need to do that. Not going down there. Oh, by the way, there's a new guy. The, the first one over there. He's a pain in the butt, man, I tell ya. There's a lot of them, too. They really whip my ass. Usually, it's it's a big pain in the butt. I don't know if there's anything for um killing them and going straight through, because there's options to go around, but yeah, I don't know. I'm just gonna get rid of this guy quickly. Seriously, I'm sick of these people. Nope. Haha. -ha. Boom. Gotcha, boy. I gotcha, boy. Let's rudd. That's right. Okay. Get my sword and shield. The idea is to come through here and not get completely raped because I seriously need my health. The boss is a pain in the butt. Like, I shit you not, he is a dick. I'm gonna go up top and get that shield because I need armor. Because it's this guy, I'm pretty sure he has a shield or something, I don't know, but he attacks really fast, just like the new guys. And then he gets all these other... Um, bandits, one that we just, similar to the guy that we just killed. It's like, holy crap, chill out, okay? I'm so sorry. What what have I done to deserve this pain and suffering? But yeah, is there anything? No, it's just the bow. Do I want the bow? No, I'm gonna leave the shield for now. I'll try it out. I'm not too sure about this, Ollie. What if they notice it's missing? How well can you trust this Terry character? Must admit, I'm having second thoughts about this whole thing. I think there's some, like, some sort of operation some people were planning on stealing something. Uh, I don't know what it was. Don't remember now, but yeah. So we didn't miss too much. I mean, there's a few like cool, important things, I suppose, but it's okay. But anyway, I'm pretty sure we're about to encounter one of those new guys. So you get to check them out in battle. Seriously, this guy's a dick. Yeah. So he's got his helmet. Kind of looks like a little mini Lord Randall. You've got to like do power attacks and stuff because that's the only way you can really get him because he's way too fast. Oh shit, that was close. That's about it. You can either stand a little bit of a distance away and then do your heavy attack, or you can wait for him to do two swings and then you can do it, but then you take the chance of getting hit. Well, I suppose you take the chance of getting hit both ways anyway, because I did get hit. But, yeah. So that's that. Um, pretty sure there's, yeah, there's a guy to the right. If you kill him, like the same guy up top, if you kill him, there's like a room that you can lead up to. You can't get through it. I'll show you soon as to why that is. Um, to be honest, I actually didn't see that straight away. I Pretty sure I missed it. I missed it the I missed it a couple times. I got killed a lot, by the way. This this level is a freaking Ah, oh, and then there's these guys as well. Damn it. Ah, oh, what a pain. Oh shit. Okay, I'm so sorry. Yeah, so you gotta take care of this guy really freaking fast. And you gotta dodge this guy. That was a good one. Dodge it. Ah, oh, what no, you fool. Oh my god. Really, dude? Seriously? Okay, I'm just gonna block. That's so much easier. You dick. I have no life now. I have no life. This is not fun. This is not working out for me. This level I find quite difficult. I've spent quite a bit of time on it, so I was, as I mentioned, I was quite disappointed uh, when I lost that fire. What's up here? Oh, yeah, yeah. So you can run across, across up top here, 
Um, then there's this here, Tyler. I'll be down at live for the rest of the day. Please get the hobbocks and helms ready. The guard will be by this afternoon to collect, and I don't need to tell you they don't like waiting. So there's up here, but if you go back down and then go left, ooh, armor. I'll take the helmet. Thank you very much. I need that. Come back here. There's a blacksmith. Oh, there's a blacksmith. I'm supposed to be a blacksmith, but I don't see a blacksmith. And then here we go. I swear I can hear something moving around behind the walls again. Must be rats. I'll have to get Charles to have another look. And then you come over here, and this is where you pop up. So the guy's just off to the left slightly. It's pretty creepy, actually. Like that's, it's kind of terrifying. Also, I just realized, why is everyone's houses underground and stuff? That's pretty... Was that a thing back then? I don't know. But yeah, so, you die, and then you come here, and that gate's open, and you, you go through the gate, and then you finish it, and then you end up on a boat. And it's so weird. So I've got to... I don't know why... Hang on a sec, why the hell am I not there? Okay, I'm confused now. I think there are choices you can make, like different things determine certain stuff, so maybe I've... Maybe I've done something differently. Uh, yeah, I have no idea. That was really close, holy crap. You're a dick, man. You're a dick, man. I don't like you, man. Come on. Show me what you got. I have I've no idea. I'm pretty sure there are choices that... I mean, besides the choices of what combat techniques you want, pretty sure there are different paths you can take in the in the each day as well. Well, later on, anyway. And now I'm totally screwed, but I'm pretty sure we're pretty much all caught up. Yeah, yeah, we're... Yeah, we're caught up. Just beyond there is the boss guy. And down here, what have we got? This is just the... Yeah, that just takes you back to the beginning. Which is all fine and dandy. Really. And then, ba da ba da ba da Is he here? Yeah, there he is. So I need to get real close to him real quick, because he is fast, I tell ya. He is so fast. Like, it is ridiculous. And he like, likes the kick and stuff too. It's like, do you mind? Are you, like, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Shit, this is why I should have used the bow. I'm so dead! Yeah. Yeah, see, I only got two off him that time. But in saying that, I did go through the whole, this whole section here, so... I'ma cut through, get some armor, and then I'ma be back. Let's try that again, shall we? But yeah, so that guy's very difficult. <laughs> Not as difficult as that big guy, because you can kind of guess what he's gonna do with this guy. I mean, you can guess what he's gonna do too, but he's a lot faster. And he's got more guys, so you have to take care of him quick. But I think with the shield, I can't do as many attacks as quickly. Well, within quick succession, but with just a sword, I can do a, quite a few swings. So I'ma see how having nothing works. Let's go, Mr. Ha ha Haxman. Yeah, see, that was good. If I can just keep doing that, and, well, a charge up first. Yeah, that was terrible. Back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. Okay. Nope. Whoa. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, you got kicks. You got kicks. That's, that's cute. Shit, I wasted that one. That was not good. Crap, 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 crap. Hello. No. Damn it. <laughs> what? Sucked. Maybe I should try my power attacks. I'm gonna try that instead. I haven't quite figured this guy out yet, but I'm gonna do it. I'll see if I get in the boat, but I don't think it's worth it. Because I have to go there and I have to come back and... I mean, it might work, potentially, but I'm not entirely sure. Let's just see how this goes. Oh, nice! I got him. Yeah, yeah. Let's just keep doing that, shall we? Oh, yes! Yes! I think once he gets to a certain point, like, we get pushed back too far, then other people come out. That was actually really easy. That was really good. Can we go... We can go up or down. I'm um, just to keep... What does this do? Oh, it's a flag. We unlocked something. Oh, good. Good on us. What the heck? We can just keep going. Ah, uh, hang a second. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I'm gonna go back quickly. I'm just gonna run all the way back, and I'm gonna go up the stairs. I don't know why we can do this. Oh, there's something on here. I'll watch this. I treat this on combat techniques. Oh, <laughs> yo. Good thing I, uh, <laughs> get back to that. Oh my goodness. Rock solid. You can no longer be knocked down by power attack. Oh, that's awesome. Respite. Whilst fatigued, your stamina... Whilst fatigued, your stamina regenerates twice as quickly. 
Oh, wow. Okay. Hmm. Oh, boy. What do I want? What do I want? Rock solid. You can no longer be knocked down by power attacks. That happens to me a lot. But respite. Whilst fatigues. That's when my bar is completely out. Your stamina regenerates twice as quickly. So does that mean as soon as it goes all the way down, it just comes back up? Or is it like it just halves the amount of time that I'm fatigued for? Oh, no, the, the options. <laughs> the options. Um, well, I mean, I don't really have too much of a problem with being fatigued. Like, uh, sometimes I do get fatigued. I'm like, oh, hang on, it's like, back up, back up, back up. Like I did before, I had to, like, hold off for a bit. Back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. Okay, that's kind of a problem, but I get knocked down a butt ton. Like, it is ridiculous. So I'm probably going to go with that one, because that happens more often than I'm fatigued and I need to back off. So I'm going to go with that one. Rock solid, yeah boy. Oh, that's hella dope. That's so cool, I'm gonna take that. And I can't go that way. Man, that was lucky, good thing I decided to go back, huh? Almost probably got stuck. I bet you as soon as I stood, took a step outside that gate, I would have been screwed. And then it'll be like, oh, you missed, you missed that. No, I can keep going. Okay, well, how far? Oh no, there we go. About goddamn time. Where the hell have you been? All right, boys. They're open for business. Get moving. So pretty close then, huh? And now the city's burned. Oh, wow. Okay. Still more to go then, huh? Interesting. Yeah, so where I'm supposed to leave off in the the episode, well, the video they got, that got lost, I ended up on a boat outside of the city, and it was... I don't know, there were a lot of corpses, like, there were a lot of dead guys, like, I'm pretty sure Weed got killed, all of my men got killed, but I have no idea. What's your problem, then? Everyone's enjoying themselves, and you're moping around like an old woman. Piss off, you're ruining the moment. You're a dick, man, what the hell? Oh, I'm sorry that you guys have, have had a fun time just killing innocent people and, and whatnot. I'm going to be rich! The sheer number of spoils! I'm gonna need a cart to get it all home. What about Randall? We won't be able to hold the city. I'm going to step outside. Well, what about Randall? Randall? Forget about him. He's stuck up in his keep. He can sit up there and look down at the fun we're having. Maybe after we're finished here, we can march up there and finish the job. I'm going to personally jam my sword fair up his ass. Well, that was intense. We won't be able to hold the city. We're not going to hold Blakesley. Hell, there won't be anything left to hold by the time we're finished. Stop looking so goddamn glum. Alright, chill out. Sorry. I'm going to step outside. Why don't you try actually enjoying yourself for once? Go find a girl and have a good time. Hell, you can borrow one of mine once I've finished. Ha 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 Yep. Yep. Thanks for that. I appreciate it. Appreciate it. Oh, here we go. Hello, sir. So nice. We're nearly done, you and I. Do you intend to hold the city? Where's Randall? I will leave you be. Do you intend to hold the city? No. I'm sure Randall's friends will be sending forces this way shortly. We will soon move to his position, but not before the men have had their fun. Gotta keep them in the killing mood. Where's Randall? Above the city. Well, I kind of knew that in his castle, right? He waits within his monstrosity of a keep. We will begin our assault tomorrow. Uh, is that where we're going, huh? Time is running out for Randall. This will be my finest victory. Uh-huh. Will it be your finest victory or will it be mine? I'll leave you be. Yes, go. Get some rest. Tomorrow will be a busy day. Okay. So we succeeded. So that's good. Day six. So three more days to go. Oh, exciting. So that's what that was. We had to break through the city. There we go. Oh, I can go now. Some more walking, some more nightmares. Good stuff. Good stuff. What's going on here? So still frame people fighting. This is really long grass. Oh, it's so bright now. What's well hey, what's going on? What's going on? Mm-hmm. Fascinating. Good story. Big trees. So some some people in the woods. Is, are we going are we going backwards in time here? Cause this all looks familiar to me. Or maybe we're going forward in time. <gasps> oh my gosh. Maybe this is storytelling and stuff.
Looks like here, Mr. Randall's making a deal with the priest of the night. Interesting stuff. Lots of playing with shadows this game, I'll tell you that, that's for sure. That's a very interesting tree, wouldn't you say? It's me! Wait, is that my tree? That looks like my tree. And there's Lord Randall, does he defeat me? Oh, all oh, these questions. And then there's Lord Randall's statue. Whoa, 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 whoa. Do you know why the statue stands in the merchant quarter? Uh, no. I don't, I couldn't care less, really. Oh, but, yeah. No. It was erected by the Merchant Guild and Trading Society. You see, I implemented a tariff on all imported grain and livestock. As a result of increased taxation, our local grain and livestock industry was bolstered and profits soared. Cool story. The merchant class earned untold riches, and their prosperity has allowed this region to flourish. Do you believe that the needs of the many outweigh the needs of the few? Uh, do the needs of the many outweigh the needs of the few? I guess so. You see, whilst my efforts brought prosperity to the local industry, unforeseen to myself, my actions also brought ruin to those foreign merchants who were benefiting from our continued imports. Do you understand? Yes, I do understand. I apologize. I wish I had a more interesting story to tell. So, does that mean he's not really a bad guy? In day seven, we woke up somewhere different for a change. How interesting is that? That's pretty cool. Huh. See, I was wondering if it would do that. I was wondering if we were going to um, have a point where it's like, well, hang on a sec, who's really good? Because we're having all these bad dreams for killing people and stuff, and I understand that's just like, um, that's just uh, shell shock from war and stuff like that, but... I was wondering also if it was because we're we're doing the wrong thing. We're on the wrong side, like morally. I mean, I know morals is very gray. It's very, yeah, it's a very gray area and all that. But that's messed up. Interesting. But in saying that, it looks like Randall's made a deal with the shadows. You know, like he seems like this really evil person, but he might not be underneath all that armor. He just makes himself appear to be evil. I don't know. I have no idea. But anyway, that's that episode. Um, I'm very sorry. <laughs> very sorry that we missed out on the first half of it. That's, that's It breaks my heart. But anyway, that's, it, it happens. It happens sometimes. And it's just like, eh, you know what? It's okay. It's okay. In the end. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Hopefully I explained enough so you guys could follow along with this day. We're up to day seven now. Only three more days to go. Wow, I can't count. It was four days before, three days now. Yeah, that's, that's better because I'm pretty sure I said something. But anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video of whatever I make. Until then, have a good day. Have a good night. Bye-bye.